Cats versus South Carolina on this lovely Saturday. Uh, last game of the regular season for both teams. Kentucky's going to need one here. Uh, you know, God, you got to play on Thursday in this, you know, SEC tournament. And if you're going to make a run, you got to start now. So try to get some momentum going your way into the SEC tournament. We know it's a long shot making the tournament. It's been a bad year. But um, you lose to this South Carolina team at the end of the day. You look yourself in the mirror and you say, that just can't happen. They gave up. So... We'll see what this Kentucky team is made of today. Boston attacks, looks, gets to his shot, gets it to go. Nothing but net. Good start for the freshman. Post, Sar looks, gets doubled. Good start. And Kentucky's off shooting the ball well to start the game. They are not very good offensively this year, but they've been doing well tonight. Boston, top of the key. Three, gets it. Good start for him. He's got an early five. They're going into the post to Sar. Free throw line kick out. Boston, Boston puts up another three. He's got eight to start. Good start for him from deep. 12-4 run. South Carolina in transition. Kentucky gets beat down the floor. This seems to be a thing that happens a lot this year. Easy two for the Gamecocks. Kentucky 0 for their last five. Saar tries to change it and does. Three ball from Olivier Saar. Jackson looks, kicks to Boston one time to Mintz. Mintz, pump fake, gets doubled. Has nowhere to go. South Carolina with a two-point lead here. Boston tries to change out with a three off the mark. But Jacob Toppin sky high off of the putback slam. Mintz looks. Tie game up early. Mintz is going to take a top of the key three here. And he gets it. Let it fly. The only bright spot of the Cats here along with Isaiah Jackson is Davion Mintz. He gets the Cats a lead. They go around the corner screen. They give it to kick out big guy from the elbow on sword gets it to cut it to four south carolina just chipping away here back and forth they go cats need a bucket here askew comes in he's trying to run the offense trying to give davion mince a quick break they're gonna go into sar jab step jumper gets it aj lawson throws one down for south carolina to get it back to single digits mince for three changes that right up as it's back to a double-digit lead, he gets going. Mintz uses the screen from Jackson, pulls up again, gets it to go. He's heating up. Here comes the transfer from Creighton as he's heating up. 13-point lead. Three ball off the mark. They go back to Mintz. Mintz has got the hot hand. Crossover. Sets up A.J. Lawson between the legs. Fade away. Gets it. He is feeling it. The rim is as open as you could be, and he's hit three threes in a row. Off the mark, off the rim, gets it to Jackson. Here comes Mitch. He might as well take a heat check while he's at it. Three possessions in a row. Could he make it four from the Rupp Arena logo? And he gets it! Timeout South Carolina. Davion Mintz has put this game possibly out of reach, but you don't know it. Askew goes around the screen, looks, picks up his dribble, goes to Jackson. Power dribble, up, finger roll, gets it! 19-point game. This is uncharted territory for the Wildcats being up this big. Askew flies down the floor, looks, sets up the offense. Kentucky keeps extending their lead, looking good, gaining confidence, going to the SEC tournament. Sar puts one up and makes it. South Carolina looks, tries to run an offensive set. They're going to go in the post. They got the mismatch with Askew on Bryant. Bryant throws one up top of the backboard. Talk about a generous bounce. And one for Bryant. Count it. Don't see that every day. Look at Cameron Fletcher. Checks in for the first time since forever. Been a tough year for the kid, but look at him run the floor. BJ gets it to him. Could he get one? He throws one down. Everything connecting on all cylinders today for the Cats. Cameron's getting involved in the action. And Lance Ware's getting some action as a good board there. Look at the Cats go. Kentucky, you know, played very well today. And credit to that. South Carolina might not be the most talented team in the world, and they might not be that great. But, hey, no matter what you do at the Division One level, when you put a team and beat them by, like, that much and dominate them that badly, to step. It's huge what you can do. Uh, you know, the walk-ons came in late in the game. They scored. And you ask yourself, could that be a morale thing? Could that, you know, could that rally the team together? Well, you know, it's not been a good year. It's been very frustrating. Very much so. But... You know, Thursday, you start off against Mississippi State. Afternoon game. You got to beat them. You got to beat them. I mean, it's, 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 it's going to be an absolute war for sure. And um, you win, you play Alabama, you lose, your season's over. So Kentucky's got to play desperate. It's not about winning four straight days in a row. It's about winning one game at a time. 
most important games in front of you, one game at a time. So big win for the Cats. It's going to be a great week. Let's do something special. Go Cats.